Hello and welcome to Minerals, Rocks, and Fossil Talks. I'm your geology teacher, Jen, and it's time for Wordplay Wednesday. So, there are lots and lots of ways that we can identify and classify igneous rocks, and texture is just one more way that we can do that. The first texture is aphanitic. Aphanitic means not visible, referring to the crystals. Typically, these form from lava, which crystallize rapidly on or near the Earth's surface. Next is vitreous, meaning glassy. These occur during some volcanic eruptions when the lava is quenched so rapidly that crystallization cannot happen. Pegmatitic. These occur during magma cooling when some minerals may grow to massive sizes and others do not. Next is phaneritic. This means visible, referring again to the crystals. Each individual crystal is big enough to see. These occur when cooling of magma is very slow. Then we have porphyritic. Porphyry develops when conditions during the cooling of magma change relatively quickly, meaning that it occurs when magma crystallizes below a volcano but is erupted before completing crystallization thus forcing the remaining lava to crystallize more rapidly with much smaller crystals. And lastly, we have pyroclastic, meaning igneous fragments. This occurs when explosive eruptions blast lava into the air. Thanks for coming to today's lesson, and make sure you tune in tomorrow to learn about the eruption that may have helped end the non-avian dinosaurs. Fossilize you later.